Hi, Martin here with another video. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can use QuickTime on Mac to record your iPhone screen. So let's get started. Okay, so there's a couple of things that you'll need for this. So obviously you're gonna need an iPhone and then you'll also need the lightning cable uh, that you use to charge your iPhone. So go ahead and plug your iPhone using the lightning cable into your MacBook. Once that's plugged in, you'll need to go ahead and open up QuickTime. Now, when you open up QuickTime, no kind of box appears to kind of highlight that it has in fact been opened, but you will see right at the top that we have QuickTime Player. So that's how we can identify that the software is now open. So what we're gonna do is go to File, and we're gonna go to New Movie Recording. Now what this will do is it will actually default to your MacBook's camera. So how we can then change this to be our iPhone is by clicking on the small arrow that we have down here next to the record button. So from here I can go ahead and select iPhone. So my iPhone is just called iPhone 4. And from here, you can now see that I can go ahead and record my iPhone screen. So once I'm happy, I can also go back into the options. I can make sure that I'm selecting the appropriate microphone that I might want to use, okay? So I could maybe switch that over to my MacBook microphone. And then from there, I hit record. Then hit stop when I'm finished. And then you can see that I have my movie here that I can play, I can check, make sure I'm happy with it. And then if I go ahead and hit the X button, it will then ask me to give it a title and decide where I would like to save it on my device. So there you have it. Very quick, very easy. And that's how you can record your iPhone using QuickTime on Mac. So I hope this video has been useful. If it has, please give it a like, comment below, and subscribe for more videos. Thanks.